What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Summer Sweeper series. And this time I'm coming at you from West Acres Bowl with a 42 foot pattern, a two and a half to one, but they seem pretty tricky today. So hopefully I can bowl well. I got a lot of bowling balls with me and I'm actually not throwing urethane today. So maybe I'll learn something, you'll learn something, and we'll get better together today. Okay. Only do so much. No, f you. Game one down, it was a little bit tricky there. Uh, I shot 177, which was actually the high on the six people on my pair. And I had some pretty talented bowlers. So it was a little bit tricky of a pair for us. I split twice, I made both of them, and I only struck two times. So 177 with an open there, not my best. However, we're looking to bounce back game two, hopefully get a little bit different of a game plan because I threw two or three different balls from the Extreme Envy, the Purple Hammer, the Dark Web Hybrid, and we'll see uh, which ball I'm gonna throw game two and which ball hopefully can change up uh, my scoring pace, which right now is very low. Dark Web Hybrid looked super solid there for me. Uh, I bounced back with a 223, which brings me back to dead even. I know the scores are really low, so I'm not really trying to push too hard. However, I know I have the pocket under control with this ball. I might be looking for a few more strikes here and now that I'm going to the end pair. I think I might even go from that Dark Web Hybrid to my Teal Rhino Pro just to get it through the fronts a little bit. Lane 36 hooks a ton. Lane 35 is more of a normal shape, so. We'll see how it turns out, but I know the fronts are gonna to start to go, so we'll see where it takes me.
up switching to the Teal Rhino Pro, which I don't know if it was my best decision. I hit the pocket a lot and I still only shot 205. So I'm plus five coming into the last game. I know I need a decent game here to actually get myself a chance to win because I know there's a couple people up there around like 30, 40 over, but no one's bowling amazing like I said earlier. Madison is hanging in there right around plus 20. She's got to be up there in the top three. I'm right around the cash line. I think they're cashing five people out of the 24. So I think I'm going to switch to that the one encore because just a hybrid ball, get through the fronts a little bit better, make a little bit more of a shape down lane and hopefully get some of those sevens and tens out that I've been leaving. So fingers crossed and I need a big one this last game. Not too deep. pausing in the middle of this video because I think there were four lefties who started on this pair. All of them tried to throw urethane the majority of practice, so didn't take any mental notes of that until I realized, oh shoot, this is where they started. Um, so they were very tight down lane. The one encore, I'm gonna stick with it just to try and create a little more of a shape down lane in some of that slop, but I don't know if that's the best decision. I guess we'll see at the back end of this game. Deal with it. So good. God, that was so good. I bowled really well. I thought I needed a double in the 10th to cash. And in reality, it wouldn't have mattered if I doubled in the 10th. I wouldn't have cashed no matter what. However, minus nine overall, I got to use a lot of those like tricks and things that I've been working on from faster ball speed to slower ball speed, posting more shots, working on the rotating it a little bit more. So I used some stronger balls than I thought I might have needed. However, I tried to rotate it a little bit more to just work on some of the flaws in my game that I currently have. So. Uh, thank you guys for sticking along all the way to the end of it. If you want to know who the winner was, it was Madison. She went, I think it was like 48 over, which was the winner for four games. Um, and she won 200 bucks, which was super cool. So Madison took home the dub. I took home about, I think, sixth or seventh at minus nine out of the 25 people that showed up. So really fun tournament. I look forward to bowling the final Monday night summer sweeper at West Acres here this upcoming week. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you sticking along. As always, we're still about to give away those bowling balls. So we have three bowling balls to give away. If you guys click that subscribe button and fill out the form down below in the description. So why don't you guys do all that? Maybe you'll be the winner of a bowling ball. And until the next one, I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Thanks for watching.